Hello YouTube and welcome to another Linux tutorial. So in this video, I will show you how to compare files and directories in Linux using the diff command. So are you ready? Let's get started. So in order to perform this example here, we have two files in my desktop. So let me show you. I have a file called file one, okay. dot txt. So the content is very really simple. It's just four lines, okay. And I have another file called file two. dot txt also. And it has actually the same content. But here, as you can see in the second line, I have here learn operating system. But in our second file, I have added the word Windows. So learn Windows operating system. So how can you actually detect that using the diff command? So first of all, let me clear that. So here, in order to compare two files, will be using the def command. So I will use the def command here and I will provide my first file which is file1.txt space then my second file. Okay. So remember we have only one line that is different from the two files. So let's see that. There we go. So now the diff command has shown the line that is different in the two files. So as you can see here, learn operating system exists in file one and learn Windows operating system exists in file two. So this is the only line that is different in the two files. Okay. So this is a very simple example that you can use in order to compare files using the diff command. You can also use in this same command, but instead of displaying actually the output in lines, you can display it side by side. I will show you how. So here I will be using the same command. Okay. But I will add an option here, minus Y. So let's execute that. Normally we have only one line that is different. Okay. So here you can see the files side by side. And you will notice here a vertical bar. So this vertical bar actually shows us the line that is different in the two files. So this is what we wanted so learn windows operating system so this is the line that is different from the file one okay so you can use whatever you want with option minus y or without it as you like you are free but for me i always use it with this option minus y so i can display the text file side by side and visually it's actually more easier to see the differences okay so now let's move on to directories so i have here still on my desktop two directories so i have a directory called folder one so let me show you the structure of this directory here so i'll use the command tree folder one so you can install it if you don't have this command here tree you can install it in whatever system you want you can install it in windows or in linux here i'm using debian but if you are using red hat or CentOS, you can also install it if you want so let's see actually the content of this folder here folder number one so as you can see it contains a couple of files but 
it has also a directory called mtrank master and inside this directory I have a couple of files so as you can see here I have one directory and almost 19 files okay and let me show you also the content of folder 2 so let's use also the tree command so the two directories are almost the same but here I have added another folder called test and I deleted some folders or some files from this subdirectory called untracked master okay so normally we should have a directory that has been added and a couple of files from the subdirectories that have been deleted so let's try actually to get that using the def command so let me clear that so I will use the same command here def in order to compare two directories so here I have a directory called folder1 okay and I have another directory called folder2 but remember this two directories have also subdirectories okay so in order for the diff command to also shows us the differences in subdirectories we have to add option here called minus r so r stands for recursive so it will also check the subdirectories and shows us the result so let's say that here we go so you can see here here it tells us that test which is a folder only exists in folder 2 and these files that I have been deleted from actually folder 2 only exist in folder 1 so we get actually our result here okay if you are not interested in seeing for example file differences and you want only to see folder differences you can use the same command here so first of all let me clear that so you can use the same command but instead of R we can use Q so Q stands here for quick report and here it will only show us the differences in folder and not in subdirectories or files so here we go so you can see here I have a result so the folder test only exists in folder 2 which is true and the common subdirectories are of course this here this folder here unranked master which exists in both directories okay so this is actually a very simple way if you want to use the def command in order to compare files and directories there are of course a lot of other commands that you can use but in this tutorial we'll keep it just simple like that in order just to show you an introduction how you can compare files and directories as always i hope it has been informative for you and i want to thank you for viewing bye bye